What's going on, YouTube? I'm back here, and I, I'm i not going to talk about the Bible today. I'm going to talk about well, I, the movie I just went to go see, Surrogates. It was it was really good. It was really good. Okay, the whole movie's about this guy. He is married, and he it wants to be with his wife again. But the problem is, is the world operates on robots now. They've created robots that does everything that humans can do. And you program, they've created something for the brain. It's kind of like the Matrix, only in the real world. And, the, and robots, okay, is what does their, all the cool stuff now. Every, the robots are better than humans. You're able to... If you're 45 years old, if you're 80 years old, okay, you can have you can have a robot that looks young and beautiful, okay, of yourself, okay, like you did whenever you were young, and or if I mean, no matter what you look like, okay, like me, I'm like horse ugly, okay, and I could get a robot that is like, I mean, like you know, looks like uh, who, who's a good looking guy. Uh, I don't know, Tom Cruise, okay, I get to get a robot, you know, that has the looks of Tom Cruise, and it could play me, um, but that's, that's the whole storyline, uh, and everybody, almost everybody in the entire world has switched over to using these robots, and they go to work, they, they lay down inside their house and operate these robots, uh, the robots go to work for them. They do all the stuff that humans do. I mean, the whole world is operated by these robots, and everybody just stays home and sl and uh, lays down and connects this brain connector to their head, and they operate. They can feel, touch, sense, smell, see. I mean, everything. And these robots do, and these robots are, are better. They look... Okay, okay, but anyways, uh, the story is humans the robots get developed and and everything's going good but what if not everything is so good you see what if not everything is that great um and then the and then everything goes downhill i mean it, it's a it's a pretty good story okay morally speaking okay i guess i am going to bring the bible into it i am a christian so let's put a little bit of biblical perspective on it Morally speaking, uh, I, out of the studies of the Bible that I do, to sit down and jack yourself into a matrix or to plug yourself into uh, these robots, okay, I, I can't say that there's anything morally wrong with this, okay? The movie tried to create some sort of moral thing that was wrong with it, but I, I don't think that there is. Um, technology is a good thing. Technology... The, the Bible says for us to learn. The Bible says for us to study, to show ourselves approved. And we're supposed to educate ourselves. And, I mean, I remind you, the Bible, okay, I've said this many times, but the Bible is a thick book. We're supposed to learn that. Why not other things? You know, God created us with a mind that is capable of holding a limitless amount of knowledge. So the so these so the moral issue is well should people use these surrogates? Does it take away your humanity? Uh, uh, is it is it I don't know. Is it a bad thing? You know, it is it the way that God intended it? You know. But anyways, it it's a really really good movie. Um, but I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Personally speaking, uh, shoot, I, I I don't think that there is. Um, let's see, uh, the movie on a one to ten scale, I'd have to give it, I'd have to give it a seven or an eight. I, I good action, it had a solid storyline. I could keep up with what was going on. Um, it had an arc that started at a certain point and then it ended at the same point um and uh, it it was just it was just excellent so basically go see surrogates it's a great movie uh i don't recall hearing any curse words in it 
the, the, it got it's got a little bit of violence um and there's and there's uh is there any sexuality no there's hardly any sexuality at all in it no sex scenes or anything like that it's a, it's just an overall great movie go see it um all right that's it i'm done talking okay i'll talk to y'all later have a good night